right, good morning everyone. Good morning. Today is day six mm -hmm. here aboard the Disney Wonder. We have just docked at Ketchikan, our final port destination for this cruise, unfortunately. Oh. Uh, but we're doing something very, very fun today. What are we doing? Yeah, we are going to be kayaking to the Tatouche Islands, I think is how that's pronounced. And then it, we're um, on the way there. So before we do the kayaking, we're taking, I think, a high speed boat over to the islands to then start the kayaking adventure. Mm. So sounds like a lot of fun. I have no idea what kind of wildlife we're supposed to see. It doesn't really advertise that we're gonna see a whole lot. Yeah. So we're just gonna have to see. Hopefully yeah. we see something, but if not, we're excited to kayak. Yeah, weather will be a little bit chilly today, so who knows what'll be out, but hopefully we see something. Yeah, and then once we get back onto the ship, I know we still have a lot of ducks to hide, so I think the plan is to later tonight go hide some ducks yep. um, for the day at sea tomorrow so that everyone will be able to find them tomorrow while we're all exploring the ship. And then dinner at Triton's, and yep. I guess we'll just kind of see what else we do. Yeah, I agree. Yeah. yeah. So come one and wander with us through day six, six here aboard the Disney Wonder while we are in Ketchikan on our seven night cruise in Alaska. Yeah. All right, heading off to the French Quarter Lounge. That's where our tour is meeting today for the, when you book it through Disney, you obviously usually meet on the ship at some point. There's been a few times actually where we've like met uh, like elsewhere. Like what was it, Grand Cayman, I think? Didn't we like meet off the ship somewhere? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, well, we were supposed to oh, meet I on, on the port, but we were super late. <laughs> So you are going to be part of the Jasmine group today. Very cool. <laughs> and make it rain, right? So there we go. And you both got either a driver's license or a passport. Yes. Perfect. Come on in. Just grab a seat. Cool. Thank you so much. Very much, guys. Thank you too. Where you want to grab a seat? Let's sit over there. After you tuck away your photo ID. Make sure you double check your bag that there is no food in it that is not factory package sealed. No fruits, vegetable, meat, dairy, or bread products can be taken off the ship. If you're caught with those in your bag, it could be a fine of tens of thousands of dollars. So don't Yikes. risk it for the biscuit. No <laughs> banana from Cabanas, leave it behind. Don't risk now, it for also, the biscuit. Also, <laughs> uh, does everyone know what the all aboard time is today? Four. 7.45. Let's say it all together. All aboard time is... 7.45. 7.45. That's very important because if you're not back on board by 7.45, it is a very long swim back to Vancouver, everybody. Besides <laughs> coming up. Let's say it's, it's, uh, it's, <laughs> loose. it's loose there. Booking it. Yeah, seriously, how'd they get that far? <laughs> that would be unfortunate. No, it would yeah. be because you only have one boat. He stands so incredibly still it becomes invisible. It's like 
vehicles are flying platforms too. That's so pretty. So secluded out here, like we passed maybe two boats on the way here, like two and little instead of kayakers. Um, yeah, this is a really cool way to see all of the Alaskan wilderness without like, any houses or boats or anything. Okay, we have dry bags. A question. What? Sweet. Actually, um, no, that looks pretty good. Hi. All right. Hey everyone, uh, my name is Nick and I will be one of the kayak guides today. I you know the term passenger princess is kind of popular right now. So I like to call the person in the front uh, um, a paddler princess. So it's just a fun term. I heard someone call, call themselves that on a tour once and I thought it was so funny that I like to use that line every time. <laughs> so we're all getting situated in our kayaks right now. It's pretty cold there. The kayaks are, are pretty fancy, or at least fancier than the ones I've used before. They they have some sort of steering system with a rudder, so they have to adjust all of that for whoever's sitting in the back. So just getting all of that situated, and then we'll be headed out. So cool. It's so cool. They are. So we're just gonna move them back a little bit. Yes. But it's a little bit long. Okay, I can tighten it. Is that okay? It should be like a little tight. Like my tippy toes are touching them right there. Okay. Yeah. Thank you. Thank you. You got it? Ah. Oh, oh, we're turning. Is that you? We're on the water. <laughs> Did you say you do have black bears? Okay.
all sad about the vacation ending? Yes. Yeah. Yeah, don't want to go home? No. Uh, want to stay in Alaska forever? Yes. That's yeah. yeah, pretty, pretty great here. Wait. Oh, hey. What is that? I don't know. There's something in the tree line right here. What is that? Get you your binoculars. What do you think it is? I don't know. What is that? Okay. Something over there, but we don't know what it was. Yes, I think the consensus is that it was probably a deer, but we don't know for sure because we couldn't see it really. <sighs> it sounded big though from when we saw it. It's pretty cool. <laughs> If you can see it, but there's a little seal right over here. Spot for some photos. Um, if you guys okay, want, um, I'm happy to take some photos. If you can pass me your phone, I'll post out a towel up. It's a seal way over there. Anyone throw me their phone today. I don't want anyone to drop it in the water. Mm -hmm. Or Lily or Russ. Wow. That's right, don't worry. How cool is this? It's so cool. Just paddling in Alaska, no big deal. <sighs> we finally saw a moon jellyfish. It was a moon jellyfish. But the only thing is, it was probably too small for us to even try to capture on camera. But if we float past another, we'll try to get it. It's like the size of a dime. Yeah, it was very tiny, but we did see a moon jellyfish. So that was cool. All right, so we came in through this way here into the heart of the Tatouche Islands and now we're coming, we're gonna go head back this way. There was a moon jelly in that video. It was super tiny, so I hope we could see it.
You're welcome. Oh, she that I know. I only have so many hands, but I pulled the kayak up Ooh. onto the beach. <laughs> All right, I'm my glasses. In that yellow jug, we had some fresh water ah. for everyone. That was fun. Cold water. <laughs> that was fun. <laughs> so, also, do you guys take a look by the line? There's some Oh, cool. Mm -hmm. How cool this is. Just on a beach in Alaska. No big whoop. Once you get back, they have hot chocolate, water, and cookies. She brings gifts. Yes. Big one or small one? Big one. <laughs> mm, cookie. Mm. <laughs> And these are like homemade cookies yeah, too. Yeah, logo. <laughs> right off the coast and it turns into this. I hear a little creek coming through here on the side. Hmm. Alright, so how have you liked this excursion so far? Mm, this is beautiful. This is like very nice excursion to get away from the hustle, like, hustle and, bustle. and bustle of the towns and the cruise ships this is just like nature <laughs> this is alaska yeah of all the excursions we've done on this trip so far this has been my favorite mm -hmm. and it's solely because the bus ride was not bad at all it's like 20 25 minutes boat ride over here was fun it's a small group of people and you're on an island in the wilderness so cool. Unbelievably cool. Kayaking throughout Alaska. That's mm -hmm. insane. So this has been my favorite so far. I, White Pass, I don't know. Maybe it would have been my favorite, but we will never know until we go back. <laughs> okay, I heard a loud buzz. I gotta show you something cool. There's a tree that was cut down, but another tree is growing out of it. You see that, Shane? It's a tree cut down and tr a tree growing out of it. <laughs> Chop. In this whole trip, we rode a train through at least part of Alaska. We dog sledded in Alaska. We walked on a glacier. Walked on a glacier in Alaska. from a glacier. <laughs> we kayaked through Alaska. Like, we ate salmon in Alaska. <laughs> we almost like, saw a bear in Alaska. <laughs> it's, it's so cool. Like the vast like array of different things that yeah. we did on this cruise is just oh, it's been so great yeah this is a beach that has such good skipping rocks let's see if i can skip one. Ooh, that was good. Decent. how's your hot chocolate hot it's made with water, so milk is better. Yeah, milk that's okay. Is better, but... I can't complain. We're on an yeah, exactly. island in Alaska. <laughs> I just love how the beach is made up of pebbles. I know. As opposed to sand. It's so cool. How fun that is.
<laughs> oh, that's cool. You have fun? Oh, that's nice. That was awesome. That's so fun. <laughs> I would definitely do that again. Or sorry, white ones have yellow signs. Oh, yeah, yeah. And then you can see the dome of my ear from here. The what? The dome of my ear. Oh, you write it. That's pretty cool. They have a gift store here. I don't think we unfortunately have time to really go check it out, but there's a gift shop here if you're interested. There's our tour ship behind us. Our so, tour ship? Our cruise ship. Uh, but we're gonna go explore Ketchikan for a little bit. So, cause what is it, like 4.05 right now? All aboard time is 7.45. So it's a late departure today. So we got time to explore. Yeah. Yay! It's like too hot for this big old jacket. Oh, except in the breeze. Okay, it's nice in the breeze. <laughs> I'm gonna say I feel great. <laughs> but my, my long pants might be a little much right now. Yeah, I'd be too cold without it. <laughs> That's a big gummy shark. <laughs> oh. That's so. impressive. <gasps> oh, I used to eat these all the time. Oh, Banana, I what were they? Like uh, runts? Is that what they were called? Oh, maybe. I don't remember what they were called, but. They have the same jelly, mm -hmm. but covered in chocolate. <laughs> do you want to get some? Yes, I do. Which one are you getting? Uh, well, I tested the pear and that one was delicious, but I also want raspberry. Can I please get two of the chocolate covered raspberry jellies and then two of the pear uh, chocolate covered jellies? Do you want any? I'm going to do two raspberry cream. Okay. Kitch candies. Oh my gosh, that's great. Kitch candies. <laughs> We just got some ketchup candies, as they call them. <laughs> ketchup <-a> candies. <laughs> <laughs> we got an assortment of chocolate, chocolate covered gummy bears, and also some chocolate covered jelly delights, I think they were called, but they remind me of the little jelly squares from the Mickey cartoon. So, and they're really good. We tried some. Delicious. We've heard so much about this lumberjack show, and we have no interest in seeing it, to be completely honest, but. We do want to walk by it. <laughs> we, we think just, we hear it. Yeah, we just heard all of the cheering for it. <laughs> We've seen enough vlogs to uh, not need to pay for it. <laughs> so ship. You can see the two beams back there. That's where the lumberjack show is. And there's the ship. So it's a very short walk right down to it. Yeah, very close. Granted that it's if your ship docks right here, but really all of the spots that we've seen Super for, close. yeah, the port would have been really close. Yeah. You wanna check out this store? Yeah. Let's go check it out. I found the souvenir I must take home. Oh my God, the price. <laughs> How much is it? You just guess. Oh, oh yeah. Like, Don't look. Actually, I thought, it was, I thought it was gonna be in the thousands, so. It's not as bad as I was thinking. Oh, oh yeah, yeah, yeah. Is it just like a? It's almost like a little like puzzle box. Oh, that's cool. Go backwards with her. Oh yeah, I won't be leaving with that Sasquatch statue because it's six hundred dollars. 
and I think that would be a little bit difficult to pack. Worth it, but difficult. Great Alaskan lumberjack shoe. There it is. Right there. If you're cheering in the background, that's what the lumberjack show is. I like how close the shops are to the ship itself, and you don't have to worry about catching a tram or a shuttle back to the tram station. You don't have to worry about traffic or anything. You just have to depend on your legs. Look at this. Oh, hey, it's the same one we it's got. It's the same one we it's got, with except a different name, right? Yeah, it says Ketchikan instead of Skagway. Oh, ah, coffee cutters. Yeah. Hmm. Who did it first? <laughs> That's the question. Oh my god, look at everyone has Bigfoot stuff, and it's great. <laughs> I love it. All this Bigfoot stuff. Do not feed the Sasquatch. Oh my god, that's a great... I love that thing. <laughs> Look at that guy. That's a beauty. That's art. Sasquatch bar. Graham cracker, marshmallow, milk chocolate. It's like a s'mores bar, but it's good. Yeah, seriously. Sasquatch. And the original bag of poo for Sasquatch. That's pretty cool. <laughs> China myself's room, we're on port side, would be somewhere in this general area, I do believe. Not exactly sure where, but somewhere over there. Six, seven, so we'd be in the middle. We'd be like in the middle in here somewhere. Yeah. Uh, all right. Well, it seems like our time in Ketchikan is coming to a close because we're both tired. Oh, and hungry. I'm and hungry. hungry. Yeah, I'm least. hungry too. <laughs> oh, hey, look at these. Those are pretty. Oh, yeah. Cool. Little statues. Look at this octopus up here. <laughs> All right, we're heading back to the ship. We're pooped. And hungry. It's been a long, fun day. The weather's beautiful. If someone was to offer you a free seven night cruise throughout uh, the Caribbean, or if someone was to offer you a free seven night cruise throughout Alaska, what would you pick? Alaska, hands down. Yep, me too. Not even a competition. Nope. Nope, nope, nope. I would agree with you on that. Also, though, keep in mind that's just because Shine and I both love the forest aesthetic. That's our number Very one favorite yeah, thing, so. If you're more of a beach person, you might pick the other one, and that's okay. This is so crazy. I've never seen them do a security check right here. It's usually always on the other side of the atrium, but this one is right here. <laughs> yeah, it is unique, actually. I've, I've, that is unique. I've never seen it from that side before. It's kind of cool. You can go on both sides. Mickey is meeting in his fisherman in his fisherman outfit, not on the glacier day. I was definitely under the impression that the characters only come out in their Alaska gear, like on yeah, glacier, on glacier day. day. That's but cool, yeah, Mickey is here in his fisherman gear, so. So if you miss it at all, you might be able to get it on the glacier day. Yeah. You never know, I guess. <laughs> Look at our awesome board. I love it, all the messages we've gotten. <laughs> Let's go get some food. <laughs> All right, see you. Bye, see you in a bit. <laughs> Cody is off to go get his coffee and I am staying behind to order the food. <laughs> All right, food has been acquired. Coffee has been acquired. Where's that coffee? There it is. Right there. <laughs> now, <laughs> now we head back to the room. So from that candy shop, we got what are these? These are shines. You can tell because it's milk chocolate, but chocolate covered gummy bears, milk chocolate, dark chocolate covered gummy bears. That's for Cody. These are like some big freaking gummy bears too. See the size of those gummy bears? Those things are big. Also some of those uh, jelly things. I don't really know what they're called. Want one. It's covered in dark chocolate as well, but the side is jelly. 
This is the store. Catch your candies. <laughs> Catch your candies. Oh, that's hot. If you were able to get a veranda for the Alaska cruise, do it. It's so worth it. I can't tell you how much we've been out on the veranda, eating food, just relaxing, whale watching, what have you. But I mean, you know, just look at the views that you have. You can't beat that. Cast them off from Kijiki. Yeah, how are you in a shortened shirt? Because that's what I was wearing in the <laughs> freezing right now. It's freezing, it's cool as Bye, catch you. Catch you. Catch you later, catch you. Catch you later, catch you. So the captain came on earlier this morning and said that because we were leaving so late, he wouldn't be doing any evening announcements. So I don't know if that means we're going to hear the horn today. Still going. We will see. I don't know. The vlogs we saw, there's a school right there and they did it for the children. It's like 8 o'clock. Why would children be there? <laughs> don't, don't they always leave the port at the same time? I think so, not necessarily. <laughs> I match really well right now with this. Bigfoot socks and sandals. Take a look. <laughs> oh yeah. Fashion. <laughs> it's highest quality. <laughs> Bigfoot socks and sandals. Look Red me. shorts, a gray jacket, and a beige hat. Yeah. <laughs> Nothing matches. <gasps> and you said they wouldn't do it for the children. Oh my god. God. Oh, I did actually hear cheering. Yeah. See? Are they? Oh, yeah, are there actually people up there? There are people up there. Why are children there? Yay, we caught the horn. Okay, they didn't that's do it exciting. yesterday, so. Yeah, they didn't do it yesterday, so. I'm glad we got at least caught that one. Yeah. Maybe that's not a school. Maybe it's like a. I don't know. You're like just a, angry, you're wrong. Oh my god. <sighs> I didn't get my ice cream. Who did it? Oh, okay. I'll be right back. Okay. Finally. Ding. Ding. Love that at Trains. We get little vest napkins. They're so cute. Just gonna go ahead and take that. All right, and here is the menu tonight. Typical Tritons. I should say typical Triton's menu, but when we open it up on the inside, that's where we have something a little different this time. So we've got our specialty cocktails, appetizers, and we have some more regional inspirations tonight. There's a Huntsman appetizer and roasted oyster mushrooms. Interesting. We have our soups and salads, oxtail soup, a tomato and onion salad, then some more regional inspirations with a white onion soup and then a roast carrot and parsnip salad. Bread selection, which this is actually one of my favorites, the sourdough bread with roasted red pepper dip. Oh my God, it's so good. Main courses, lobster tail, Parmesan crusted chicken, red snapper, some more re regional inspirations. And there is actually a lot for the main courses. So there's sea halibut filet, venison medallions, and then bulgur wheat. Very interesting. 
We have our vegetarian selection, pumpkin and coconut curry, and then the lighter note offerings with the specialty one tonight being smoked duck breast salad. And there you have it. Feel free to pause the video if you are an interested in learning a little bit more about what these are. All right, so I got the beef steak, tomato, and Vidalia, Vidalia onion salad with no onions. Um, this is a gluten-free and dairy-free option. That's pretty good. Salad dressing's a little bit sour for my taste. Um, so I'm, I'm gonna give this a three out of five. If you like a more sour dressing, then you might like this a little bit more than me. But I like it when I have like a sweeter balsamic or strawberry, you know, something that gives it a little bit more sweetness to the salad. So three out of five. I got the fettuccine with Parmesan crusted chicken. However, this was something that um, our wonderful server, Mina, uh, told me that they could make gluten-free. So instead of fettuccine, um, I got gluten-free spaghetti. So that's really cool because I didn't think I was going to be able to have any spaghetti, but this is a gluten-free meal. So very cool. It smells delicious. It looks delicious. Oh. Doing it. Five out of five. Wow. This is delicious. And it's a very good change from the typical, uh, you know, herb, lemon, chicken, or steak or prime rib. It's a very good change, which I'm a fan of, especially on seven night cruises. Food can get repetitive very quickly. So five out of five, highly recommend. Even the gluten-free option, it's delicious. Granted, Shine got the regular fettuccine, so we'll see what she thinks of that one. All right, I went crazy tonight. I got two mains, mostly because one of the regional inspirations sounded really good. It is the marinated bulgur wheat, and I like bulgur wheat, so I just really wanted to try it, especially because with this, you know, being an Alaska cruise and with there being regional inspirations, for the food, I feel like I just had to try one of them. This one sounded the best tonight. So yeah, I, I, did, I don't know what it is that it seems like is, is missing or that I would change about this. There's something, but I can't really put my finger on it. But just for the fact that it's something different and it's a regional inspiration, and it is still pretty good. Like I, I don't, I could keep eating this for sure. I'll give it a three and a half pause out of five. It's not bad by any means. All right, this has been sitting at the table for a bit now. I got two entrees. I feel like I regret this every time it happens, but I got two. <laughs> We're gonna see how the fettuccine with chicken parmesan is. Just regular style, because Cody got it gluten-free tonight. So let's see, finally. <laughs> So oh, I would give this, I feel like it may, may not be as good as the gluten-free one because I, I would give this maybe like a, a four out of five. I don't know if I could quite give it a five out of five, but then again, fettuccine is not my my favorite. I got food poisoning off of it once, so it's always kind of left a little like, um, a, a, not, not a bad taste, but I'm always a little, a little hesitant around it. So maybe that's why. But it's still very good. Four out of five pots is not bad at whatsoever. Here is our dessert menu for the night for Tritons. We have, and of course, as always, pause if you need to. But we have our usual specialty drinks, after teenies, and selection of spirits. And then we got the good stuff over here. The desserts, which you already know what I'm gonna get. Most likely, if you watch the other vlogs, this one right here, this bad boy, the lava cake. The Captain's Table Sunday is also a good runner up, but it just, nothing compares to this. And then we have the no sugar added dessert and regional inspirations, which I feel kind of bad because I like to get a regional inspiration. I did that with the baked Alaska, but this is just, you can't not get it. <laughs> Cody is not happy. <laughs> I was talking about the lava cake. <laughs> I do not. 
All right, I've got the lava cake. There's just, this is the best dessert, hands down. We've now seen Mickey, Donald, and then we saw Lumberjack Goofy on today's di uh, After Catch a Can. I thought I would be great at that. Oh, Zach and Corey are in it. Wait, hold on. Now I want to get that real quick. Yeah, not like that. I would succeed. Oh my god, That's our okay. friends Zach and Corey are in it. What are they doing? I know, I didn't forget about you. But give them a round of applause. They were great. Don't do me again. No! Okay. All right, we can... All right, so our camera died at dinner, but I think it's pretty obvious that both of our desserts are five paws out of five. <laughs> Chocolate lava cake is just... And then... It... Cody loves the raspberry sorbet since he's able to actually eat it. <laughs> we also, on our way back from dinner, stopped by the Azure Lounge because our new friends, Corey and Zach, were playing the Seriously game in there. And it was pretty great. <laughs> oh, what is that? <laughs> we did get bootins. We got three bootins. Yeah, gotta grab them. All right, I'm good. What is this? <laughs> Is that a wiener It's dog? a wiener dog! Yes. Oh my gosh, with glasses on. Okay, Let's fully appreciate this wiener dog here. Oh my god, great! Oh my god. He's got a tail too. And he has a little tail. <laughs> this is I think this may be one of my favorite That's towel animals. <laughs> this has gotta be one of my favorites. This is so great. <laughs> ah yes, let's see him in all the lighting. <laughs> His full glory. Yes. Oh my God. And a little tail. I love it. It's wonderful. Five out of five on the towel animal. <laughs> Many hours later. It's like 3.30 in the morning. We are gonna go hide the rest of our ducks. I think we meant to do this at like one o'clock, but we fell asleep. We went back to the room, took a maybe longer nap than intentional, mm -hmm. but napped for a bit. And there was a time change, so that is a reason why it's a little bit later. But now we're hiding some ducks. the same idea as us and they came out here like 10 minutes ago <laughs> where'd you find it it was in our hiding spot that we did the last one in here Ooh, very cool no note with it no no so we can yeah. rehide that one if you want gonna, to yeah maybe it was a rehide yeah. and they took the tag add it to the to here
thing. <laughs> <laughs> I think you can take the hood off now if you want yeah, to. That's true. Oh my god. <laughs> Breathe. <gasps> <There you go. laughs> All right. And so concludes Alaska Wonders <sighs> Duck Hiding Extravaganza. It's crazy because it was that. It's like four in the morning now. Well, Wait, yeah, we look started. at your phone. My phone is still on the old time because we jump ahead an hour. So it's four of six right now. It is. At least I think it is. Pretty sure. I, yeah, yeah. We'll need to double check, but yeah, I think it might be four in the morning. Uh, yeah, it's definitely four in the morning. <laughs> let's go to bed. Yeah, let's go sleep some more. <laughs> All right. Hello, hello. everyone. Uh, this is the technically the end of day number six. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> yeah. Um, technically the end of day number six. We are definitely leading into day number seven. However, <laughs> we needed to do a late night duck drop off so that no one saw what was happening. Uh, and yeah, she, she, she had to go put her babies somewhere. So they are now all hidden. They are, they're in, out in the world on their own. <laughs> But today was an amazing day in Ketchikan, uh, so amazing kayak adventure, and then just exploring the town. We had a great time, and tomorrow, though, is another day at sea, so we get to do more ship stuff. So Yeah, yeah we have not done very much trivia today, so no. we are hoping to do some trivia tomorrow. Granted, there's a few happening, so we're not too sure which one we're going to do, but, you know, just tune in to find out and then we have dinner at animators palette tonight it is the or sorry tonight well i guess it kind of is tonight yeah. <laughs> dinner at animators palette tomorrow night and it's gonna be the drawing one so super excited hopefully my drawing will be better this time we'll see i have not practiced meant to did not <laughs> right. yeah. and then we'll see what else we get up to tomorrow so yep so if you like the videos please make sure you like and subscribe so that you can get the notifications for all the new stuff that comes out. Yeah, and turn your alerts on so that you know when the next video posts. But until then, we will wend and wander with you tomorrow. Good night. Bye, everyone.